Hello everyone, it's me, the Heroic Source, and today is my anniversary of my channel. The one year anniversary of my channel, basically, since the first video was Dimetrodon and Meragia unboxing. Or Meragia, I don't even know how to pronounce that, Daniel. But anyways, uh, today we're going to be unboxing this Marvel Spider-Man figure I found at Target today, which I was very happy about. Marvel Legends series and Marvel Chasium figure. This is basically Ben Riley. And it says in the back of the box, basically, a new fatal battle between Peter Parker and his clone Ben Riley leaves the rising from the quantum goo as a villainous Chasium. And to be honest, this figure is pretty cool. They also have the other characters like Spider, Spider Woman, Miles Morales. Uh, they did not have the Ben Riley Spider Man. That was weird. I really wanted that one also. The Tarantula Man, and they had the other the other two characters that I don't remember who their name are, but they're like there's a Daredevil. The female version, and it's like this other guy with a purple mask and a rose. I don't know his name, but yeah. But anyways, uh, he I think he's a villain. But anyways, here's the Marvel Chalcium figure. He's pretty cool, actually. And yeah, let's get to the boxing, shall we? Alright guys, so I got the figure when off screen basically because I didn't want to open it. And the good news is the box is still okay. Look at that. It's still a good box. I should have probably did that with the with the Spider Gwen figure that I unboxed. And if you don't know Spider Gwen, check out that video. So we get the little plasmas out and of course we can get the figure out for Ben Riley. AKA the Chasium version. Oh fuck, it's kinda hard actually. Oh, hold on, let's get him out. Come on, let me get him out. I am just this guy out. I'm just gonna wait. Come on, Chazio, aka Ben Riley. Okay, there we go. That took really long. Get out. Get the plastic out of here. I'll clean that up later. Alright. Here we go. Here's the Ben Riley figure. Oh, fuck. Okay, give me a minute. Alright, guys, so here's the Chazio figure of Ben Riley. So, of course, he has head rotation. Just, he can move his head all around, basically. Oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. I really hardly use this figure. Oh, well, his little thing just fell, but I'll put that back on. He comes with these little things. I think those are supposed to be the plasium. Going through his era. Kind of reminds me of the deco figure I have, actually. He has bendable knees. And, of course, he can have bendable knees without bendable arms. Pivot here, a swivel here. A swivel. We got a swivel here. A swivel on the arm. We got a rotation up and down. Go all the way in the back. That's cool. That's cool figuring. I like this figuring so far. Uh, can make a lot of cool poses with this figure. Give me a minute. Alright, so here's a pose that I gave with him. Uh, kind of a, a taunting pose. And here's my Spider-Man. And to be honest, he... I didn't even notice, but he has a really good torso. Because you like... Yeah, you could, he has a little torso arm. I did not even see that on the figure, but that's pretty awesome. I did not expect that on the figure. But I really like... I really like this figure, actually. Not gonna lie. I did not expect it to be this good. The only thing that's just... These little... Plasma just falls every time I try to pose it, which pisses me off a little bit. Because the cause the, the Zuko Midoriya figure I have like that has these, but like they don't fall, which is kind of weird. But I don't know why those, these fall. Maybe I put them on wrong, or maybe I put them like... I'm not really sure, but yeah. The real question is, is it worth buying this figure? Well, if you're collectible, I mean, I'm a collector actually, sorry about that. Then I would recommend this figure, unless you guys like keeping it in the box. But yeah... 
if you're a kid or a 13 or 14 year old that likes to play with these figures, to be honest, I don't really play with these figures. Actually, I just like keep them on like my stage, basically. Like I keep them, I keep them on the stand, basically. But like, it is pretty cool figures. This this figure, I'm gonna give it a nine out of ten. It's a good, it's a really good figure. It has really a lot, a lot of articularity. But the thing is, is that I just wish these were like very annoy, unknoyable, Leslie. And another thing I wish is that I wish it came with like extra hands, basically, like the grabby hands, because it only has the fist hands. I just wish it came with that. But maybe if you have like some kind of like hands that look like the ones that the Chazium has, like black glove hands, then maybe you could like work with it. But yeah, this is a really awesome figure, and I would recommend it. Anyways, um, hopefully when I go back to Target, I could find the Boss Morales, Spider Woman. Or the other Ben Riley figure, because there's two of them. There's this one and the other one, but I couldn't find the other one because they, had, they did not have a him. So, he may be a hard one to find, but anyways. Thank you guys for watching my channel, and I'll see you guys in another video. Thank you very much, and thank you for coming to my video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone.